Hi everyone, I hope everyone's well and has been enjoying the sunshine these last few days. I know how hard it is to have to stay inside during this beautiful weather out. Um, but we're doing the right thing, we're staying safe and that's the main thing. So I've recorded this video to give you a bit of motivation and encouragement during this time and a fun activity to go alongside it. So what we're going to do is a rainbow treasure hunt. So a lot of you might have seen in Windows or maybe you've done it yourself with um, where there's pictures of rainbows being displayed in Windows. And now I think that's a beautiful reminder of God's promise. So in Genesis 9 verse 13, it says, I am putting my rainbow in the clouds as a sign of the agreement between me and earth. So that was when there was the flood and Noah built the ark and that was God's promise and that's when the rainbow appeared when the flood was finished and God placed rainbows in the sky as a symbol of his promise. Today the rainbow is a symbol of hope for us and it reminds us that God keeps his promise. So what we're going to do is there are different color objects that you're going to need to find around your house any objects it could be a toy it could be something in your kitchen obviously it's something safe if you're lucky enough to have a garden maybe it's something in your garden but when you find the object of a different color so we're going to find a red an orange a yellow a green a blue a pink and a purple um object and when you find the object that of that color you're going to say a little prayer so the red prayer would be, thank you, God, that you love us and that you are always with us. The orange prayer will be, dear God, please help us to be patient, to wait and listen to you and be obedient while we wait for this crisis to end. Then the yellow prayer, dear God, please look, please help all those who are scared. May they know your perfect peace that takes away all fear. I've been praying that one a lot over and over again because during this time I can find I feel quite anxious, but one fantastic thing about God is that he's there, he loves us, he's listening, and he's the same as he was yesterday, today, and tomorrow, no matter what we're going through. Um. So, and then when you find an object with green, you're gonna pray, dear God, please look after all those who are sick. Give them the treatment and the help they need to recover. Send your healing power into all the world. Then when you find something blue, you're gonna pray, dear God, please protect all those who are working for the NHS. Thank you for all they are doing to protect us. Then purple, thank you God that we are the children of the King of Kings. Thank you that even though we are in difficult times, we can trust you and pray your kingdom comes. And then the last color is pink. And our prayer is, thank you, God, that we know you will bring us through this crisis to safety on the other side, just as you protected Noah and brought his family through the flood. Now, I'm going to upload a little picture on Facebook um, on the last spring page where you um with the colors and the prayers that you're going to say so don't worry if you never heard got them all i'll put, upload a picture after the video um then what after we've done our treasure hunt what i want us to do is there are some really powerful promises to really encourage us and it's god's promise that we can find in the bible so what i want us to do is you're going to need four pieces of paper and loads of different colors you can be filter pencils pens paints whatever you would like to de decorate your page and i'm going to tell you the promises and the verses from the bible i will again put that up as a picture on facebook but um what you're going to do is you're going to write the verse out on a piece of paper and then decorate the background however you like bright and colorful really attractive really getting their attention maybe you could have a background of a rainbow and then your verse inside it um and display them around your house for you and your family just to remind us of god's promise during this difficult time so one of the promises from the bible is joshua 1 verse 9 and it says be strong and brave. Don't be afraid because the Lord your God will be with you everywhere you go. 
Then another one is Jeremiah 29 verse 11. I say this because I know what I am planning for you, says the Lord. I have good plans for you, not plans to hurt you. I will give you hope and good, a good future. Then Mark 1, 11 verse 24 says, So I tell you to believe that you have received the things you've asked for in prayer, and God will give them to you. And the last one is Romans 8 verse 28. We know that in everything God works for the good of those who love him. So once you've written your verse in the middle, um, decorate the page. Maybe if you want to feel a little bit younger and you want to just write the the where the verse can be found in the Bible and then decorate it. Um, ask your parents to help you. Um, again, the verses will be on the picture on the Facebook page after this video. I hope you have fun doing this activity and let it be a reminder that God is always with us. He loves us.